hot, very hot. Mm. There's no magic cube inside and it's very nice. Okay? You can actually cook your things natural. In fact, no magic cube, so it still come nice. Ah. They expect they will. Yes, I'm coming. That is it. Bon appetit. Ah. So nice, so nice, so nice. So nice, so nice. guys i will be doing pepper soup with this fish tonight first i need to clean them like you can see i have to cut this one and do a bit of cleaning on them so let's do it you see what i do i just put them here to be able to clean them because i love fish but i hate the smell when it's not cooked but i really love it yeah it's my best what i like to eat i like fish a lot so so to clean the fish what you need to do what i do is i cut this away like that okay i cut this also okay. i make like that So you don't want those shell for your fish so that's what i do so you know fish with their smell it's not easy smell fish so this is already done you see it's neat inside This fish can be with a lot of bone. So this is the fish. I wash it already. And this one is, I just soak it a little bit with warm water, with warm water, not, not some hot water it was. But right now it's cold because I soak it a bit. Okay, you can see the way it's, it's clean inside. Okay, so I'll wash. Put them here, I'm going to start adding the spices, okay. Without spice, I'm going to put. It's optional, you can decide to do your pepper soup with just pepper and pepper soup spice. But because I, I like vegetable a lot, so I kind of had, this is ginger, garlic, this is cereal, and just little, just a tiny tomato, it's not tomato, yeah, we don't want a lot of tomato inside, because it's just for the flavor only. But the problem is that I don't normally eat Maggi cubes, so I do, I blend this, yeah, to replace, like the cubes, I don't normally eat them, so... Because when I eat the cubes, I start to have stomach problems. So I tend not to eat cubes, maggi cubes. So what I do is I blend vegetables like that. And I use them for my pepper soup. The reason why I had it quickly because I want it cooked together with the, with, the, with the pepper soup. I want it well cooked. Okay? Like I tell you, my stomach is very, very flexible. So... I tend to be careful what I eat, okay, that's why. So, what you see here is like the way I do mine that, that doesn't make it to hurt me in my stomach. Because I put garlic, ginger, and there is tomatoes, just little bit tomatoes, not a lot of it. And there is onions, I eat a lot of onions. I have problem. Onions, I love it. And I eat a lot of it. And onions is very good for the high side, if you know. So I close. So I will be adding pepper to it. 
I'm going to add salt. Okay. So I'm going to add pepper soup spice. This is pepper soup spice. Okay. I'll just be relaxing with my homemade ice cream. Yeah. I'll scoop it. Look at that. That is mango. Last time I showed the video, I did this mango. They are all made ice cream. At this level, it's ready. Okay, it's just ready. It was pepper soup, like I told you. Yeah, it's ready. See, the fish is already cooked with a lot of water because I'm going to drink it. Yeah, pepper soup. What you need is the water, the water and that fish. So.